Welcome back to our call on the internet. Okay, so Trent read this vid by Hot T and it's called Nikita Dragon Arrest News and Jake Paul versus Andrew Tate announcement. <laughs> okay. Plus, Jeffree Star starts retiring. Jeffree starts retiring. Okay. Okay, a bunch of mini stories here. Okay. Well, I heard about this Nikita Dragon arrest thing. Don't know what the arrest is for, but yeah, I. I don't know nothing about this. So, yeah. So, yeah, sure. I got a bit of time, so yeah, why not? So, without further ado, I'm about to get into this reaction. <laughs> Literally, I just came back from uh, delivering parcels, basically selling all clothes that I don't wear anymore. Selling more minted. Okay. Yeah, I'm hungry. I feel like my tea right now. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel where we spill tea left, right, and everywhere in between. Nikita Dragon was arrested this week while in Miami because she allegedly caused a disturbance and was being extremely disorderly. Hotel security. So basically, drunk and disorderly. Police officers of this behavior and also mentioned that she had been walking around the pool unclothed. Security mentioned as well that when hotel staff approached Nikita, she threw her water at them. When police arrived at the hotel, <clears throat> they went to Nikita's room to question her. Loud music could be heard from inside of the room and after knocking on the door and identifying themselves as police, they informed Nikita that she would be escorted off the premises. She apparently slammed the door and then reopened it saying, oh my God. do you want more? Where she proceeded to throw more water on the hotel security and the police officer she was arrested <laughs> on a felony assault charge for this Shit. in addition to a misdemeanor battery and misdemeanor disorderly conduct Damn. charge according to nbc news her bail was two thousand dollars seemingly nikita was be just going on a bit of a rampage during the miami trip with there being an incident it's basically a drunken she rampage claimed that she was quote escorted out by six like by six security guards because they knew what I was about to do that. What I was about to do that, man. There's another woman in my presence. My mother taught me, uh, son, dad, and that. Just put that to Dracarys. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I don't know where she got that from. That's Game of Thrones for you. But oh my god. Tell her this girl's on a drunken rampage. <laughs> Nikita Dragon is not one of my favorite YouTubers at all. In fact, I don't even watch her content or anything like that. What I hear about her is her just being problematic as hell. But if I had to pick any YouTuber to go on a drunken night out with, I think it'd definitely be Nikita Dragon, for sure. <laughs> Nikita tweeted, bottom line, I see a man put hands on a woman, please call the cops, cause would you forget, I know I look like a doll on the outside, but I still hit like a dude. That same day, she posted this video to her Instagram. This is for my mom to show that I'm not in jail. Okay. Mom, I am not in jail, okay? <laughs> that she was arrested. <laughs> I should recognize and mention here that Nikita has been open about her mental health this past year and expressed that she had been diagnosed with bipolar as well as committed into a mental health facility in December. While mental huh? health issues do not excuse they don't excuse it. violence, that can be something that can explain how <laughs> someone could end up in that situation. That explains a lot, but it doesn't excuse anything. Talking about public figures and influencers, <laughs> Mentioning that is important. We want to be delicate while mentioning mental health issues, but not disregard any mention of them at all, if that makes sense. But something that is extraordinarily disgusting in this case is that Nikita was held in a men's facility. During Nikita's no. hearing, her 
representation attempted to get the bond dropped from the $2,000 total that was being set to which the judge denied. The judge did say that even though the hotel did not want Nikita coming back, she would allow her to go and pick up her things while under the supervision of a police officer. But Nikita was obviously and understandably I'll call it the concerned shot. about where she would be held. Your Honor, I have one question. Sure. Um, do I have to stay here in the men's unit? Yeah, I don't make the rules up there, but it okay. should be a proper accommodation for you. You should be in a separate, a separate area. Can you, you can contact the um, bondsman to try to get the you out. Honestly, the lack of empathy at all from the judge is pretty shocking there. Mm. I'm sure the judge could do something. She just kind of seemed over this case, in my opinion. This was I'm this over it. This trial was on Tuesday, November 8th, and Nikita was released after staying behind bars for about a day. She didn't end up having to pay the bail since she was released on her own recognizance. While the assault and disorderly conduct is one thing, and of course a penalty should be there yeah. for that, the fact mm -hmm. that Nikita was held in a men's unit is just honestly so disturbing. A mm. representative of Nikita said, The situation with Nikita, who is legally female, being placed in a men's unit of a Florida jail is extremely disturbing and dangerous. This yeah. decision made out by the Miami-Dade County Corrections Department directly violates their protocol, which mandates that transgender inmates are classified and housed based on safety need and gender identity nikita has been released and is now safe honestly thank god for that mm. what an actual terrifying situation to be in and nikita girl if you somehow end up watching this i would consider legal action if <clears throat> at all possible the real upsetting yeah. and scary thing about this is that nikita is not a rare case of someone being arrested and held in the wrong place like this according to npr it is a common occurrence for many trans individuals incarcerated in the United States. In practice, many corrections department place individuals in facilities according to their assigned sex at birth or genitalia at the time that they're arrested. This is regardless of research showing that transgender inmates face greater <clears throat> risk of assault and abuse. The Miami-Dade County <clears throat> has actually met with a lawsuit before for doing exactly this. Back in 2020, three transgender individuals were misgendered and later went forward with legal action for the alleged abuse no. that they faced. Nikita has a new single coming out, which she has been promoting, but currently she has her comments on Instagram off. We are just glad that Nikita is safe now, and her next court date is set for December 7th. In other news, Hope you her lesson, lo know her limits. A new series with Jeffree Star again, but Jeffree Star spilled. Dinner is solved with HelloFresh. Download the app. Yeah, and use the I use HelloFresh once. I'm not using it again. The tea on his current online <clears throat> presence. So, no, sorry. So you make TikToks? I, okay, so I like TikTok. Are you a TikTok? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I did one thing on TikTok when you asked me that was silly, but I'm not doing like. So are you going to like show me what a Jeffrey TikTok is? Yeah, like, you want to get Jeffrey is not as active on YouTube anymore, much like most of the creators from his time, and he says that he has been so much better for his mental health. In addition to moving out of LA and spending less time on his phone, he just feels so much better these days. As for his YouTube career, he's done. Do you want to talk about quitting YouTube? Oh! Might be time to hang at my butt. <laughs> No more Jeffree Star reviews, no more Hang up, flat screen. no more apologies. What do you guys think? Is this legit or homemade? I don't, and, like, I don't know. And I don't care. I don't watch Jeffree Star, so I wouldn't know. Below. This is the second part of Shane's new series, and if you haven't been keeping up with it, it's basically just a revamp and more low-key version of the last series with the pilot. When Shane initially uploaded the second part, he titled it The Retirement of Jeffree Star, but he quickly changed it to The New World of Jeffree Star, and he changed the thumbnail too. 
People are speculating that this change in title on thumbnail could be because maybe Jeffrey isn't serious about retiring. But in my opinion, it isn't unlike Shane to do this. The changing of the title and stuff, he probably just had second voices <coughs> and then changed it and might even change it again. He has done that recently with another upload of his on his main channel. And if I remember correctly, he changed it like three times so this isn't out of character for him and i don't think it's really that deep to be honest but while speaking about large creators that we don't see around as much anymore a hot tea favorite andrew tate is having our headlines once again i'm so sorry you guys but jake paul teased a video on twitter this week of what seems to be a possible suggestion of a fight happening between tate and paul <laughs> So there's not many YouTuber influencer fights that I would care to see or ever pay for, certainly. But this one, I just might. We are there. Actually, of course you do. Team will likely all be there for this one. There aren't many details. Oh, so you just want to see? I just get bad. <laughs> that's what it is. That's all that Jake has really said about it. But we will keep our thumb on the pulse and let you guys know when we do. But that is going to be it, is that it? for today's video. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the Hot Tea channel, okay. and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out. Yeah, uh, yeah, I get the idea. I got, I got the idea. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, what can I say about this? <laughs> In regards to Shane's documentary, I haven't really watched, watched it. I think I watched one one episode or two episodes, but it's kind of like, you know, you know when you just play each video um, to have something play in the background whilst you're doing other things? Yeah, I think that's the case with Shane's documentary. I did that. <laughs> what can I say? I don't watch his videos like that anymore, no, so... His video's like an hour long. I miss the comedy skit days, but to be fair, them comedy skits were offensive as hell, so it's kind of like, yeah, it's a good thing that they're kind of off YouTube. Um, I found it funny at the time, but now I'm like, yeah, now I see why people were so pissed. <laughs> but yeah, anyway. <laughs> That's when we got to that. Nikita Dragon. Yeah, what happened to her was peak, but at the same time, I'm kind of like, yeah, drunk and disorderly, you are going to get punished for shit. I mean, I wouldn't mind going on a night out with Nikita Dragon. That'd be that'd be hilarious. Imagine that. Imagine that. It's not every day you can say that you uh, that you got shit faced with um, Nikita Dragon in LA. <laughs> but yeah, sure. <laughs> and, and, and I'm gonna jump right into the comments. See what people are saying right now. Nikita deserves to uh, to be in jail for the shit uh, she did, but putting her in male jail that's disgusting. Also, wow, first time I'm rooting for Jake Paul. Yeah. First time too. No, normally I'm like Jake Paul's a fucking prick. <laughs> so yeah, that's the only time I'm actually like my Jake Paul batter Andrew Tate. I just wish um Jake Paul w uh, would have kissed Tate on the uh, on the nose. It w it would have been hilarious. <laughs> really? Uh. <laughs> Someone said I'm not rooted for Andrew or Jake. They both suck. Uh, but the thought of uh, the thought of Austin McBroom. Uh, watching the fight salty because it's more successful than all of his uh, combined brings me joy. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, don't give me sorry, Austin McBroom. Damn, she is wilding out. I wonder if she's uh, no longer taking her meds or what's going on with her. <laughs> That's actually a good thought. But yeah, she's out here wilding. <laughs> Damn. Look, so as you know, you, ha uh, you had a crazy uh, weekend. Uh, when someone ends up in the neck. You know what I'm saying? Oh my god. 2k for Bell. Uh, why, uh, why Why? was she that, there so long? She spends more uh, more than that by blinking. I'm far from a fan of Nikita. But, uh, but that along with them placing her in a men's facility is wrong and kind of sus. I'm on the side of what's right and and that was wrong. Yes, I agree. I agree. So <laughs> said Shay Dawson is still a thing. When I heard he came out to YouTube, I was like, okay. <laughs> you know what I mean? Basically, all the YouTubers I used to watch back in the day, when I, back in like 2012, 2013, I don't watch like that anymore. Right? Like, seriously, like, I don't watch Shane anymore, I don't watch Joe Except anymore. <sighs> I don't watch Lily Singh anymore. So it's like, yeah. The YouTubers I watch back in the day, I don't really watch anymore. It's a combination of two, of two things. One, me getting older. Two, 
me being super busy. So yeah, honestly, I'm so out of the loop. I don't know. Who, I don't know who's cancelled. I don't know uh, who's still in the grace of the public these days. I just don't. Well, got bigger fish to fry. What can I say? Uh, 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 still hit like a dude. But if someone hits you like a dude, there would be a huge problem, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> I can't, man. I can't with the comment section on YouTube, but yeah. Yeah, I, I, I got my... I got my daily tea. And, um... I gotta go. <laughs> Mostly because I'm hungry, but yeah. I gotta go because I've also got other things to do anyway. But food is definitely the first first thing to do after this, but yeah. Um, in, interesting vid. Um, know your limits. And... Yeah, let's. I hope Jake Paul knocks Andrew Tate out. Yeah, I said what I said, and I said it back again. Cool vid. Okay, so that's it for this video. Like, subscribe if you want. I post if I'm about. I feel like it, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.